Hello, welcome back to day two of Vlogmas. Um, I just put batteries in the washer and I did not realize until it was done. So I wonder now I have everything in the dryer, if there's anything that I put in there that um, it's going to make my apartment explode. So let's hope it doesn't, but I'm going to be unboxing day two of all of my giant advent calendars. I swear, one day I'm just gonna leave the house and you're not even gonna know that it took me two hours to do that. I'm trying to decide if I should wear this, but like I spilled on it, so I feel like I shouldn't. I also wanna show you what I keep in my purse. I always have my crystals on me. If someone's like bothering me or is around someone that was kind of annoying or like I just don't like their vibes, and I'll just like cleanse myself. I'll like literally cleanse myself in the middle of a party. Back away, Becky. I also just realized I haven't eaten, but I also don't have any food. I normally eat garlic as a natural and I've Okay, the fire alarm's still going off. Maybe they're just testing it or something. This is an outfit that I'd wanted for forever because I'd seen like an Instagram influencer wearing it like years ago. And it was so expensive. I think it was like $250 per item. And guess what? I got it thrifted. I found it. It was $25, $25 for each. And I was like, hold up, wait a minute. And it's my size. I also have a tank top on underneath in case I get hot and have anxiety and start having a heat stroke. I need to take it off immediately because I can't stop breathing. You know, I broke a glass. Yeah, I've never broken broken a glass in my house. Maybe that happened so I could have a funny moment that I broke a glass and, and, and show you guys because it's so funny and it's never been done before on the internet and no one's ever seen anything like that. And that's pure comedy. Or like cut my finger cleaning up the glass and the hospital I go to to get it stitched up, the nurse is gonna end up being my husband. That's how you gotta think. That glass broke so I could fall in love. Thank you. I appreciate you. And that's, and that's the secret to life. You're welcome. Who I just thought was kind of funny and I just realized maybe I wear a lot of blush and highlighter because when I do the a selfie on Instagram, like a thirst trap, and I do the Paris filter, it kind of like blurs it a little bit, but I still want to pop a color, you know? I just realized that I was walking around and there's only like a little like, a little like clip of my hair hanging. The rest of it's literally just out. I don't know if you can see it like a rat tail, but I think it's really cute and trendy. So I just wanted to let you know that this is the new trend for 2023. It's um rat tails. Thank you. Wait, there's an ambulance. I don't know know what to do. It's always awkward when you're the first person in line at a green light and there's an ambulance because like, what if I'm the one that, oh shit, what if I'm the one that does the wrong move, you know? Okay, I think I did it right. I just, I just chilled and I paused. Does anyone else sit on their phone like when you have to do stuff and just rewatch your story like a million times? Like I watch my story probably at least a hundred times throughout the day. You know like when you're like waiting for your crush to view your story so you're like imagining how they would view it or let's say they just watched it so then you have to rewatch your story or like if your crush just follows you, you have to like restock your Instagram page and be like, what's their like Perception of me. What are they gonna click on? But you know what I mean when you're like, you see that like your crush viewed your story, so you're like, oh my gosh, like now I gotta watch it and like think about their perception. Like, what were they thinking when they saw it? Like, do they think I was cute? Waiting for them to start t t typing. Come on, like, no, okay, this is not this is not true. But like, imagine this. I know where you live. I Google a restaurant that I would assume you'd like, or you've told me you've liked before. I find a picture on Google that looks like, or on Yelp, Yelp. So it looks like I'm there. Post it to my Instagram story. Don't take the location. They know who's hungry. No, you don't say anything. Make it seem like you're alone. <laughs> I'm just kidding guys. I'm just kidding. I'm not crazy, but I'm a mastermind. Play mastermind by Taylor Swift. I'm in this new era where I just live, laugh, love for myself. Whatever works out and comes into my life is what's meant for me. They want me, they can come and find me. But also, if they're posting that they're somewhere, I might have to drive by and I might have to accidentally crash into their car just because like, how else are we supposed to say hi? <laughs> Okay, let's put my groceries away as I talk to you with a light ring because I'm professional now. I know. I got some sea moss because it helps my skin and my gut. Some Dream Pop, really good dessert, but I already ate most of them on the way home. If you can feel it, which I know you can, my floor is currently vibrating. There's a concert happening below me. It's my below neighbors, never met them. Have I thought about putting on a hat and a disguise and going downstairs to say, hey guys, it's me, your friend. Do you mind? I, I feel like I've heard once in the hallway passing by that your neighbors think you're too freaking loud. Do you mind shutting the fuck up? Do you mind not having a concert at almost 9 p.m.? What if I was a teacher and I had to wake up to teach my little mouse children tomorrow. My little children. What if I had to wake up and teach children tomorrow? They wouldn't be happy if, if their little teacher was cranky. That was so fucking weird that I just did that. That was so 
so annoying. I'm sensitive to sound sometimes. Not always. I love rock shows and I, and all that fun stuff. But when I'm in my sanctuary, if you sneeze, I'm gonna I'm gonna lose my train of thought. If you blink at me, I forgot what I was thinking about. If I'm a writer writing a book and someone walks in the room, my book's done. I'm done writing because I completely forgot the story. I'll never be able to think of it again. <laughs> I'm not dramatic. I feel like I'm like the kind of YouTuber that tries to do this kind of stuff and like the antics to make it like all fun and exciting. But no, that just really came out of me for real. That was not like a stage thing. That was real. So are these. Put them away, Jack. Ah! Why am I being so fucking cringy? Maybe I have a cringy personality and I never knew it because I've been silencing myself because I've been afraid to talk to people. I'm not actually afraid to talk to people. Dear therapist. <laughs> Whoa. Maybe I'm a little bit lonely. Okay. Um. Um. Yeah, but I've called the cops on them is basically what I was trying to say. I've had security go and tell them, knock, knock. Can you keep it down, please? Because they were doing it, honestly, at like 4 a.m. and like 6 a.m. and like had these major concerts where it was like shaking my tables. Oh, wait, it looked like it was snowing for a second. Maybe it's raining or maybe I'm seeing things. Do you know what I thought of today? Do you know what would be funny? If I bought a mistletoe and invited my crush over and just had it hanging. Let's, let's just get to the point. <laughs> okay, let's see what's in the moon of the Charlotte Tilbury. Oh, it's hard to get out with my claws, but this is the Charlotte's Magic Serum. I've heard amazing things about it. It's supposed to be like really good. I'm excited to try all these out. Okay, day two for ah, Victoria's Secret is oh, a big drawer. Let's see. Oh, it smells so good still. And I've got some pink confetti. I love that. Oh, a, I didn't know they made makeup like this lip gloss. It's called passion it looks super dark and now we've got bloomingdales okay i know i'm chopping my head off but let's see what number three is oh x nilo paris i'm not sure what that is why are these so hard to open up with my claws oh another perfume let's see if it sniffs good oh it smells sniffable oh it actually smells really good i feel like this is what like a pretty girl would wear at the bar when you pass her um so it's giving pretty perfume vibes look at that oh if I was day two, where would I be? I found you. Let's give it a sniff test. Oh wait, that smells really good. I'm gonna save this because I feel like this would be really nice. Like if you're like on a date or something and you wanna smell good randomly, like kind of giving like a little bit of a lemony scent. It's just really like refreshing and smells really fresh. I also realized that I didn't do any intros or outros for any of my vlogs. So I'm gonna say on this one, thank you guys so much for watching. I'm so excited to be uploading Vlogmas and stay tuned for tomorrow.